Hello and welcome back. How can you throttle messages so it does not overload your application? Also, we don't breach an um, agreement with our external services. You can very easily solve this problem by using a design pattern called Throttler. Okay, Throttler is a widely used enterprise integration pattern and there are several ways to, to implement uh, that design pattern. But in today's workshop, we will be implementing this design pattern using our favorite framework called Apache Camel. Okay, so let's just first try to understand what is the business problem which we are trying to solve. So the business problem in hand is that let's say I have some sort of incoming IoT data. Okay, we have several IoT sensors which are kind of streaming data and, and it's coming to our application. When we started our application, everything was good. Okay, we had limited number of um, IoT devices or IoT sensors which were sending some, some sort of like you know, manageable data. But now like you know, uh, more and more people have started buying IoT data. Suddenly, you know, my, my application is receiving a huge volume of data. So what my business really wants is, so they're saying given an incoming IoT data, so they're not saying like, you know, how much in, uh, incoming data is coming, but what they really want us is basically they want us to protect our application. So given an incoming IoT data, then application must be able to control the incoming requests per second. Okay, so let's just try to visualize this problem as well. So we have like, you know, on the left hand side, as you can see, we have a bunch of sensors, which are kind of streaming data, which is uh, coming to this, this middleware, like, you know, it could be um, Kafka or it could be, you know, IBM MQ or, or Rabbit MQ or whatever. And then we have this application IoT processor. So as I said, in the beginning, when we started, like, you know, we had maybe one or two sensors, but now suddenly, like, you know, there is a spike in, in the data and our application is overloading. Okay, it's crashing um, many times. Okay, because we can't can't process process this much of volume. So we like to put some sort of control at this point over here. I like to put a control saying how many messages should be coming inside my application um, per second or per minute or whatever that that you know whatever our business is. So we have a problem in our hand. So let's go back to our our ide okay let's write some code and let's see you know how we can fix this problem very easily using apache camel okay so this is our application so what i have done over here i have created a little simulator which is um every 10 millisecond it's like you know streaming or sending uh, some message and this message is coming to rabbit mq and then our application which is uh, iot processor at the bottom okay it's reading uh, those messages from rabbit mq so if i quickly um, run this uh, existing application so we can see like you now uh, what's really happening okay so you know we are sending maybe you know whatever uh, 10 um, a message every 10 millisecond and then we are able to receive that and let's just just assume for a second like you know if there are like you know um, maybe hundreds of, of um, um, applications or the data generators then our application will be really coping because on the left hand side you have like you know a um, huge number of, of data creators or data providers or or these devices but my application is just you know one one application it cannot um, you know it cannot consume this much of volume so what the uh, the problem is we have to we have to put some sort of controller so i'm going to stop this application okay so how can we solve this problem very easily in my application or, or where i am consuming the data i am just going to put a throttler Again, see, this is Apache Camel. I don't have to write a bunch of code, you know, you know, um, a bucket or a counter where I'm kind of managing that, okay, um, you know, in, in last one second or, or two minutes or, or five minutes, whatever, I have read this messages. So then I can put a sleep. So I don't kind of, you know, consume this message. You don't have to do all this thing. Okay. Very simply, what we're going to do is we're going to put dot throttle. There we are. And what we are saying is I want to consume 10 messages per second, just hypothetically, just say so, so we can see something on the screen um, really interestingly. By default, Apache Camel um, uh, gives like, you know, what, whenever you use throttle uh, method over here, it by default, it will be reading per second. Okay, what I mean is whatever number you put here is, is basically per second. You can reduce or you can increase this, this time unit. You can say, I want to read 10 messages per minute for example or i want to read 10 uh, messages per half a second whatever that is i'm, I'm just trying to you know uh, make make some scenarios over here 
So what I'm simply trying to say is, if you really want to change uh, the the time period in millisecond, you can say like you know maybe 500 or 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 1000 or 10,000. Uh, sorry, um, like you know every 10 second, I just want to read maybe 10 messages. It could be anything. Okay. So let's just uh, remove this bit. Just stick with our one second uh, scenario over here. If I run my application now, let's see what will happen after adding one single line into our route okay so let's zoom in a little bit clean the screen so we can we can focus on one thing okay here is the interesting thing we are still sending a huge number of data okay like you know you can see the counter is literally touching a thousand now but i am receiving only 10 messages per second okay if you just focus on the received side you will notice every second the, the the counter is going by 10 or 11 depend like you know when when i'm when i'm printing this number if i now take you back to rabbit have a look at the rabbit okay so this is the rabbit uh, queue which is saying that i am receiving around 89 90 messages per second from 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 external services but the application or I am able to send only 10 messages per second. Rest of the messages are, are staying in, in RabbitMQ. Now, we have managed to put some sort of controller or throttler in our application just, just by adding one single line. This is how powerful um, you know, Apache Camel is. You can very nicely, very easily uh, implement these type of complex business problem or you can solve these type of complex business problems i hope uh, you enjoyed this a uh, very short session okay you you like this design pattern if you liked it um, please give me thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you have not um, and leave me some comment if possible try to share this video with with your friends or on some sort of like you know professional uh, social media networks like linkedin etc I'll, I'll i'll really appreciate it Thanks uh, for watching the video. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.